Welcome back, Wowsery, and the new core patch one has dropped. And it'll have the first of the campaign. Which is kind of exciting to watch a little bit. And it's, uh, you, know, you only get the two powers at the moment, Britain and Germany. Uh, and uh, it says you can span from 18, 1890 to 1940. Uh, you can only start in 1890. I guess... Uh, Right now in this build, you can only unlock up to 1910. And there's no current peacetime. I kind of wish I had read all this before getting right into it. Because I was like, wait a second, Germany's already at war with Britain, huh? So there's no up diplomacy or alliance or anything like that. And as I said, your goal is to survive and beat your opponent. The economy, they're saying, working at a minimum level. So you can get used to it a little bit. <clears throat> And the technology is not finalized, so you have some things right there. The map is limited. I noticed that a little bit, but it is something to to see. They did add a couple of new hulls, the Mogami, uh, another Japanese heavy cruiser, a light cruiser, he scout cruiser, heavy scout cruiser, experimental cruiser, German modern modern battleship. A smaller variant of the Bismarck class. U.S. modernized dreadnought. Uh, based on the California, the rebuilt California. Huh. Have to take a quick look at that one. French experimental battleship. I just want to take a quick look at that. Let's see what this looks like. Whoops. Design. And I guess is that supposed to be it? Hmm, kind of a weird, weird superstructure. Yeah. Looks like that's it. Yeah, that's, that's about what it is. I'll play with that later. And let's take a quick look at the Japanese. I want to take a look at that heavy cruiser, the Mogami. Oh, here we go. Cruiser. Hmm. Let's see. Interesting. That looks kind of weird. Well, anyways, play with that later on. Let's get on over to the, the campaign here. Do a new one. As you can see, you can. You can do some difficulty. Not really sure this is too important right now. I'm, I'm going to auto create because that's a bit faster. First time I did this, that went really slow. I mean, it took literally like 20 minutes to go through. Uh, the one thing I do have a slight complaint about right now is the fact that moving the map around is a bit difficult. I mean, watch where the cursor is, and it just... Yeah. At the moment, you cannot move ships. Some people have been trying. They've already put that in the uh, forum. Now, why can't I move ships? It's disabled at the moment. But let's just take a quick look here. What we have, got the world map right here. It does tell you who you're at war with, what you're building, active fleet, unrest, prestige, monthly balance, naval funds. We're going over to the finance right here. This right here, the first top number, that's how, if you didn't do anything right now, that's how much more would be added to your funds. 
this is how many much funds you have and a crew pool that does have government unrest prestige provinces and your fleet uh, currently I have eight battleships 13 heavy cruisers 13 light cruisers and 12 uh, torpedo boat destroyers uh, you can increase your sh shipyard size which I'm going to do and you got this little slider you can go up to 24 months six months let's do a thousand tons build that now during war right here if you uh, do notice you want your capacity to be above a hundred percent if you do go below I guess uh, you won't get some bonuses crew training tech budget let's increase that And how much money you have, fleet maintenance, total expenses. And right here's the the research. If I read, thought I just saw, I think this is still kind of in flux. So you may not be able to do too much right here at the moment. It may change. But you can go through and take a look what's being researched all that good stuff the ship designs and if you click over here you can see what they are right here go on through Let's see my battleships currently are uh, 11 inch guns not too bad 21 25 knots for the torpedo boats light cruisers 19 Five inch guns and my, I guess, good look right there. Seven inch guns, 18 knots. You can build a ship. Actually, I'll build a couple more torpedo boat destroyers. Let's build four. That'll work. And if you notice the budget right there. We'll just go ahead and do a turn real quick. Mine laying equipment for destroyers allows conversion to mine layer destroyers. Huh. Interesting. And nothing really happened this turn. We'll do another turn. Get something. Here we go. Oh. Nine inch guns. Mark two. All right, the British Empire lost three transport ships in the sea region of North Sea, so they've lost some transports. And here, if you click battle on the mission list that comes up, it'll take you to the battle. It'll show you what it is. It looks like a battleship versus battleship. And you can click on it. You can do those as well. This one only allows these two. The Tirpitz versus King George V. That would actually be a... Real life ships, that that might actually be a quite a interesting battle, but uh, these are pre-dreadnoughts. And you can do auto-resolve. And it'll do it. Uh, unfortunately, I sucked in that one. I kind of lost that battle, medium damage. So it's 75 to 44. 75 for those... Uh, uh, transports that I sank earlier. He lost another transport and a convoy mission. And let's see. Hmm. Oh, battleship again. I'm going to auto resolve that one. Ugh. Lost a light cruiser. Not good. So I'm not, I'm not doing too good in this one already. But, again, this, this you know, things could be subject to change. I do hope there are a few things like maneuvering in the uh, map becomes a bit smoother because you know, if I start down here and click and go all the way on up, the map doesn't move very much. I like to see the map more responsive. I mean, it's responsive right there, but as you zoom out, it becomes less responsive. 
So I would like to see that noise resumed in and out. Same responsiveness. But overall, no, uh, I'm looking forward to the other navies. I'm going to play around with this and I'll give it a bit more, see how it goes. I'd like to see that the uh, diplomacy start coming in, seeing how that really works. That'll make things really interesting. But uh, so far as a kind of a sneak peek, I guess you could say, that doesn't look too bad. I, I'm I'm hoping that things will really start uh, coming along here. Yeah, I'm getting my butt kicked right there. But uh, let me know what you think. Well, just a quick thing. I didn't really do in the battles because there I've done plenty of battles and that type of thing, and so there's really no point in doing in that kind of showing off the other stuff and in, in this one. Uh, let me know what you think. I'll probably maybe do a Mogami or uh, maybe the California, you no know, 1941, 42, 43 California battleship. Play around with that, get that one going. And uh, I'll see you next video.